Welcome back. A cancer survivor with a new lease on life wants to share his life-saving treatment. He's the first patient in central Illinois to undergo a new form of therapy. It's called heated chemotherapy treatment. News Channel 20's Evan Peterson introduces us to the survivor who wants others to know there's hope. Joseph Smith has done a lot in his life, and now at the age of 74, he can add cancer survivor to the list. Worked on bridges and Farm 30 and hospitals and just other buildings. He was an iron worker for 30 years where he came in contact with asbestos and mineral often found in older buildings. Back when I done that, we didn't know anything about it. I mean, nobody told us anything about it. Same way in construction or as an iron worker. Decades later, he was diagnosed with stage four cancer. Given about 18 months to live, he sought medical treatment. Dr. Gunai told him about a new procedure. He did chemotherapy treatment. And what we do is a combination of surgery where we debulk the tumor to the point where we can't see it anymore and then administer heated chemotherapy through a pump. Right into Joseph's abdomen. And after an eight-hour operation, it was done. Joe's wife, Linda, says since the procedure, she's looking at a new guy. I was very surprised because I read all the literature that they gave us. And quite frankly, the literature does not give you much hope. Mm -hmm. he's, he's doing pretty good, though. Side by side with their four adopted children, the two prepared dinner, wearing bracelets with their new family's motto. Stronger than cancer, never give up. And yeah, we've never had him off since we got him. Even Joseph has one, a reminder of where he's been and all that he's overcome. This said it'd be probably a year, year and a half before I was back to where I was doing everything outside like I used to and everything, but I feel great. Having had such a profound experience with this procedure, Joseph wants others dealing with these rare cancers to know there are options. Every individual's different, so you know they may opt for the operation. If they don't, they're fools because it's, it's a life-saving thing. Evan Peterson, News Channel 20 at 10. Since Joseph's operation back in October, two other people have undergone this procedure. All are reportedly doing very well. Dr. Ganai stressed, while it has worked for them, the treatment doesn't work on all cancers. Those interested in the operation should talk to their doctor.